How's it going guys? My name is Graham and welcome to the third of Nutcase Nightmares, the game series. Reimagine the game. We got a little polder, portal gun wielder who I don't know that character, Buzz Lightyear, <laughs> Woody, uh, the actual robot from Portal, a tank man, a few generic -y looking people. Is that like Edward Cullen or something? I would be disappointed in myself if I was actually legitimately right about that one. I don't know, a double rainbow guy, maybe? I should recognize who those are, the, like, red women there. Not immediately obvious to me. Anyways, that's just an opening thing there. We can try and actually go and, and play the proper game now instead. That was a little bit horrifying, <laughs> actually. I'm, I'm again just looking at other random characters. I don't know. We just play the game instead, and I'm sure we'll learn all about it through that. The character maker, presumably? All sorts of achievements to, to work through, which there's a, a thousand points in the, in the preloader is a thing. Oh, you have to do it to literally a hundred things. Oh my god, okay. I wasn't sure how much each one was worth. Oh, I have no idea. The way they bang around and do each other and stuff is worth more points as well. Achievement! Death by slow internet. <laughs> or, instead, you just, uh, you, you monster. Or, you just go back and, and, and play it completely outside of the realm of the internet. I'm just noticing that the lock part of these locks, the slot part of these locks, is the little game character, which that's just brilliant. That's like too clever for me. Revolutions, ruins, and rainbows. Oh, so maybe it is the double rainbow guy. Maybe I was right about that. Hey, they, they did away with the, the like scribbly background. We got an all new background there. And I think even the main character thing has been redrawn slightly. Small step, giant leap. What in the heck? No, not really. Are we just running through a world of memes? You want an achievement just for starting? <laughs> Jeez, fine. So yeah, give that back. Don't claw that achievement away from me. Nonsense of entitlement. <laughs> yeah, hook me up, you know? To skip after a minute. Oh, okay, well, no, that's fine. I, I, I would enjoy running through here and seeing what kind of weird ass madness has been concocted around here. Andy, like, is that, uh, you know, Woody and Buzz's owner, Andy? How, how far can I actually make it? Presumably there's a limit. Oh, no, eventually you chuck yourself off of real edge. Think inside out the box. I guess I did eventually end up outside the box. I don't think you understand the gravity of the situation. Inception the game. In a game, you go level up. Inception, you go levels down. Oh, I totally saw this guy, Cobb. Is that, was, was that his name? Leonardo DiCaprio's character. He totally was in that loading screen, but it's his little goatee seemed a little bit generic. I missed what that one was. Yo, dog, something on that sign. We got a, like, a remake of the hallway scene. This is actually just kind of like, that's a legit mechanic. You have to go derper. <laughs> derper, dob, cob. What the hell can I think of what the character's name was? Jump. Oh, no, no, I want to see all the jokes. Meme within a meme. <laughs> That joke seems obvious in a way, and yet somehow not. What are we playing here? Fancy Pants Adventures? That was really over the top. <laughs> then you got the Leo, like, happy stroll statue also on the beach of his, like, subconscious there. Blasted through all the memeception. Directed by Christopher Trollin. Brew, brew, brew. Inception, an exceptional film with great reception about dream conception and deception. Contraception? It just rhymes. It doesn't apply to the rest, really. Rainbows, double rainbow, double jump. Oh, ho, ho. look at that delicious rainbows. If you paid attention on the intro screen, you would know what to do. We wouldn't need the tutorial. Relax. Dying's okay. Unicorn horns everywhere. Dying's okay. Don't need to worry about it. I think the Dumble Rainbow guy passed away, which is kind of sad. Oh, the spikes are rainbow, are, are unicorn horns. Well, that's just lovely. Aw, oh, come on. I'm quite bad at this, apparently. 
Gotta get the timing. No, you gotta wait till the the like gravitational direction there shifts. Since it doesn't make any sense how rainbows make me feel this gay. There's an amazing ability here, gay. <laughs> Fucking rainbows. Those look like juggalos. Oh, because they got their magnets as well. How do those work? Because it's now a triple and rainbow that can be seen. Harb many, harb many. Oh, love. There's such a amazing combination of like double rainbow and somewhere over the rainbow and layering together things same as memes within the memes these jokes when you hear them and see them feel obvious and you're like i should have come up with that lady gaga the meat dress looks raw 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 <laughs> oh wait this isn't was that one of lady gaga's outfits then oh it's the meat outfit i should have recognized that for sure and they combined the meat outfit with Super Meat Boy. The big the big saw, the wall jumping, that's absolutely what they're going for here. Come on, make it over. Don't get killed by a saw. Oh god, I don't know what the what's up with the telephones. Oh good. Thank you for not making me restart the level. Holy crap. The amount of times like this is bringing back some like repressed memories of being really bad at Super Meat Boy and taking like a million attempts at a level. I don't even, I don't even think I beat that game ever. Alejandro! Ah! No! Okay, you can't ever stop trying to move up. Wait a second! Did I not insert gay get laid joke? Is this not where I came from? So where am I trying to go? No, this is new. This is new. Yes. The arrow was wigging me out. Who's this bowl cut guy? Is he Alejandro? Wow, okay, the gravity there gets a little confusing and hard to manage. Hatched this way? Instead of born? Like you're you're born from an egg, Lady Gaga? Is this a part of you that I am unfamiliar with? I never I never heard that. Maybe I better pick up a, a documentary or something. Sexual and shocking. Sex cells, vex cells. P -p poker face, Al Alejandro, b -b -b my telephone, S stop st stuttering. Does she do that? I know the p -p -p poker face one, that's the one everyone like makes fun of. Does she do that in a bunch of her songs? I like know that Alejandro, I don't even know, Facebook. Though these characters don't have faces, okay? Oh, big duck face is what's going on there, and they poke you, which itself is just funny. Alright, leap, full leap. Wow, that's really difficult to get past. They're really obnoxious and aggressive, aren't they? Farmville, service your farm, harvest your crops. I think I'd, I'd rather not. Ew, why does that flower look so disturbing and like fleshy? Oh, it was one of these little things, but like pink. And I don't know, being digested by uh, a man-eating plant. Facebook, our server farm harvests your info. Yes, that's far too true and has never stopped being the case. That was something about signing in there. Like if Facebook uses like and then like YouTube uses like and then like, why shouldn't everybody like like? Like a G6, a plastic bag, P. Diddy, the only girl in the world. iPad the game, disorientation lock. Apple turns the aperture science. Now you know why there was free portal for Mac. Innovative, lots of white, white, run by a despot. We'll just hop straight through the, the iPad is a portal. Haha, <laughs> iPads and blood. Just try not to die, okay? The button switches the gravity. Yes, that's okay. That was what was needed. Absolutely. Oh God, bouncy. I didn't even touch anything. That one just automatically played itself out. Did, did, was that not the one I'm trying to go into though? Did I end up in the wrong portal? Okay, because I was thinking like, wow, that was a that was a simple solution then, wasn't it? Bouncy, dang it. Oh, that's so difficult. The 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 actual gameplay to go along with this series has never been so complex before. 
Usually it's been so much more about the jokes, I can't believe I lined it up and had it exactly right. You got it, you got it. Home right on the edge here. You don't want to hop too high or else. Oh, maybe it was just flipping based on a time thing. I don't know anymore. Bot friends forever. Quick gravity flip, just slowly keep it rotating. I'll just hang tight until you allow me to, to drop where I want to go. Jump across! It didn't work at all how I had planned. <laughs> oh, do I have to live through a full rotation? What else is in this direction? Oh, goodness. Okay. That's possibly more promising. Maybe this is how I needed to do it. I, I, I'm, I'm, I'm losing faith, though. Ah, oh, damn it! If I begin rotating that as I want to run around without any excessive jumping. Ooh, and then this will drop me to where the other button is. Right? But I kind of just skipped by going to that button before. Ah, dangerous. So many spikes. Dislike. <laughs> okay, this is the right way to go about it. Hesitate. Do not want to die on unicorn spikes. Phew! Grab some delicious cake, please, yes. Mocking the iPad in a flash game. <laughs> I'm so brave <laughs> To this day probably still deserves some level of mockery and Apple users aren't gonna know anyways Because flash isn't supported by Apple products Toy Story 3 winner of 2011. Oh my god. My tears are crying award <laughs> Woody and Buzz together Andy Ooh, is the third I uh, like I can switch to Buzz is the third character the box no, I can just switch between the two here. To infinity? Beyond? Oh, here's our third and then fourth. There's a, a lot of characters to play as. He grows up and becomes a frat boy. Oh god, what is he gonna have in there? Like, drug paraphernalia? Uh, liquor? <laughs> condoms? I don't know. Everyone will love... Everyone you love will leave you. Oh, <laughs> this is Potato Head. You wanna you wanna carry us forward here? That button seemingly did nothing. Just a just a bunch of heartbreak. Oh God. Okay, gravity broken. Everyone getting chucked into just a fiery pit. I'm so sorry, everyone. Well, it's your turn. Time to time. everyone just ooh, it got reset. Is burning everyone to death not the solution? <laughs> really seemed like it was rather uh, encouraging of that. There's these two walls here. I'm trying to see if which button actually opens that up. It's just a matter of hitting all three buttons. They aren't progressively doing anything, like individually. Slinky, you're getting chucked in there first. Sorry, my boy. And did I did I leave some characters behind? Biggie. You're the you were almost the only one. Stop crying. It's just a story about having a loved one leave you after so many years and you lose all previous meaning to your life. In the face of this existential crisis, you regress to an infantile stage of denial. No owners means no heartbreak. You alienate your friends and lie to yourself, insisting that everything can still go back to the way it always was. But through enduring your personal purgatory, you learn to come to terms with reality. You properly mourn your loss, saying one last goodbye to your loved one, for you finally realize it's for the best for both of you. And with your companions by your side, you can finally, finally move on. That's like a happy ending, right? And then they just went ahead and made a fourth one, which I never saw. The third one was too damn good of an ending. Lost. This entire thing is going over my head. I know there's like fog and a door. You just it's lost the, the game. Locke is a character from Lost. Forwards on this island. Believe and believe with Locke, Sawyer, Kate, Hurley, Sayu, Jin, Soon, Ben, Claire, I'm, I'm, I'm guessing Hurley I know is a character from, and Jack, from Lost because of the Weezer Lock, album. We ain't coming back. I don't know why that was a Kesha song remade to have something to do with Lost. 
Oh yeah, the fog, which is like a lost thing. But I, I just don't understand at all. <laughs> Whatever joke beyond that is, is not for me to understand. Ooh, this is kind of cool though. Chuck yourself through. I bet you I would probably enjoy Lost, I just never bothered. Fucking magnets, how do they work? Gotta have that joke in here more than once apparently. Aww. Oh. Alright, I gotta be quicker than that. Gotta become the fog. Rock it up and switch. Oh. There we go. SS not pennies. I imagine these jokes will mean something to someone. I probably gotta be whizzing through here. Flying through is probably a, a equally <laughs> uh, a good word. Probably a better word choice overall than whizzing my way through. Oh god, there's so much. No! <laughs> How do I make it through this? Quickly is the main thing. Okay, deactivate and then fast. Oh my goodness, there's too many considerations to make. The mechanic of changing into a cool fog monster is dope. But I'll just never understand what it has to do with Kesha. Oh, I was so close to dying there. Oop. Where? Oh my god, there's too many buttons to be pressed. Okay, I did manage to press that one though. Oh, I botched it. I blew it. That was my, my, my moment. And I lost it. Let it slip. Eminem would be so disappointed in me. I'm sorry I let you down, Marshall. No! <laughs> oh, thank goodness it resets me to the right spot. Switch! Whew, see you in another level, brother. Which, I don't know, that's probably seeing another life or something. It's probably a quote. Lost doesn't have that many characters. It's just slightly more than the number of characters a Twitter message has. At the time, probably 140. Now, 280. It's been updated. Give me a verb. Rebel. Give me a noun. Rebel. Oh, rebel and rebel. What's this for? Mad Libyans. <laughs> now in stores. That wasn't even, uh, the game, was it? Just kind of a weird advertisement. Intermission, achievement, unzipping something or other. Uh, this kind of glitches out the, my, the game I'm playing on a little bit, because I'm playing it outside of a web app so that I can stretch it and make use of the vector art and have high resolution, but it means that there's a disconnect to the advertising there and it doesn't work. Oh, I wish that I would have had the full... I missed the beginning of what he was saying, however, the Freudian symbolism of Toy Story seems too heavy-handed. Is this guy just criticizing everything? I mean, we get it. Andy has a single mom. We don't need to know that her toys were also named Woody and Buzz. Oh god, yeesh. But I digress. Overall, a promising start to a scintillating magnum op opus. One to which we may observe through a high-class monocle getting wasted on high-class champagne and wasting your high-class or in-class time. Truth be told, I'm actually pretty wasted right now. Oh my, it appears I have wet myself. The scent is of strawberries, soap, and strawberries. Mm, yes, quite. I wanted to see if it started looping back ar around, and now a word from our boss, welcome to the intermission. This is a good time to collect our thoughts, it might be re-looping now, and reflect upon what we have borne witness to so far. Juxtaposing the mainstream Gaga with the indie Meat Boy deeply moved me. Plus the bold expression of not singular rainbows, nor double rainbows, but triple rainbows. However, the Freudian symbolism, blah blah blah, we've looped back around. Thank you for your comments. Comic book movies read 24 panels per second, which is a famous per second joke. Dark Knight, why are you so serious? Why? I don't know if I've ever seen anyone use the why you know in that way. Iron Man, fucking magnets. There's a real dedication to the magnets thing. Watchmen, hit girl. Big Daddy, consequences will never be the same. Brain slushy, which a hit girl's like a kick-ass thing. Uh, must make it across, no, just totally, totally dead. 
God, I hate 3D movies. Just looking at the, the 3D glasses, which I'm aware that's not like how 3D glasses work anymore, but even so, I just hate them. And then I stumbled upon the worst hack excuse for a punchline, the meta self-deprecatory joke, the end. No Scott Pilgrim. Hey, you try making a game that parodies a movie based off a comic book that parodies games. Point is, comic book movies have had a kick-ass year. Kick-ass, lol. <laughs> Blockbuster the game. 3D films, depth perception, and flat characters. Ooh. They are Twilight characters, aren't they? And then we also have Black and Swan. Black Swan, and that's no BS. <laughs> Oh crap, I landed directly on top of that. HP and BP? Expecto Petroleum! BP Energy. Land on it just in time. Who? Avatar? Minions? Oh god, I can't believe minions are still a thing. The other Avatar, which was atrocious and did not do well. Crappy Alice in Wonderland. Don't snake with me. The Mad Hatter, despicable meme. But seriously, this meme's old. Took Avatar. There's a first you mad. Oh, that's true. I guess they probably couldn't have just named the movie Avatar, even if they wanted to or whatever. But maybe they wanted to name it uh, Avatar Last Airbender. Maybe that was always purposeful. Slip right on through. Just a, a bunch of splats. 3D, the auto-tune of movies. And when Kesha makes a 3D music video, run. Just fucking run. I actually really like Kesha. I don't really know her music. I know the brush your teeth with a bottle of Jack or whatever. And I know a couple of her more recent radio hits. I know I've heard them at least. But I really respect what she did. She made Kesha with a dollar sign S as like this frat party college anthem type music about ridiculous partying, and then transitioned to Kesha with a regular S and just started making the music she always wanted to make, which is really emotional and really shows the range of her voice. The whole thing was just to provide herself like a doorway into the industry, and she knew she'd get more attention for being like wacky and outrageous rather than just being a good singer. I think that's really smart and really cool and good for her. Airport security, fighting for? Freedom or just fighting freedom? Undress up game. 0% complete. Drag and drop and, and slowly rip off all their clothes. I feel horrible doing this actually. It makes me feel very bad. Privacy invasion at airports? Lol. lol. Replace security with free bacon. <laughs> Killed Osama. You mad? Keeps Muslim extremists out. Stops TSA agents from molesting you. Give me some, no, better than airline food. Infinite Nobel Prize. <laughs> Problem, Homeland Security. There's so many memes laced into there. The free bacon itself is like a meme too. It would be like a dry your hands in the bath bathroom and it's supposed to be hot air going under your hands but it just looks like it's dispensing bacon. TSA Hearts Tea and Day. You didn't need that privacy. You were going to log on to Facebook anyway. Kind of sad, but like the nine years after this game was made, the conclusion has largely just been privacy is overrated and there's not really that much evil corporations can do with their data anyways, except for like, you know, make targeted ads, which like, that's weird and invasive, but if that's the worst they were going to do with it, okay. I realize there's worse parts of it, but like, that's the majority of what it's used for. WikiLeaks, lol's transparency, get it? And this must be like the WikiLeaks guy. I know very little about the actual people involved in that. Oh, we're coming back to like the portal-y, bouncy stuff here. Can't quite go to the States. Can't go to the UN. Military, please. Oh, we just got a dead Osama here. Top secret, holy tits, soldiers kill people. Oh. <gasps> <laughs> That really, like, hurt my lungs. That was a, a maybe too aggressive of a gasp. <laughs> Over to the States. Top secret. Sweet assholes. Politicians lie. <gasps> no! No, how could they? How did we not see this coming? 
You bastards. You blew it up. You animals. And top secret lulls. Ah, uh, Ablegate. Cablegate? Shitting bricks over that one. And with that, we'll just go get sucked away into the void. If you have nothing to hide, you have nothing to fear. Just starts paddling him with a scanner. Thanks, Uncle Sam. You can give it, but you can't take it. I'm shocked that people are shocked. Maybe we're just shocked that all this hasn't already leaked out on some politician's Facebook? Middle class, female demographic, age 12 to 18, give or take a couple of cougars. Hold down space for your beaver call. <laughs> Just quick baby babies. I guess at the time beaver was still like a teen idol rather than like, I don't know, a, a weird adult who has made a lot of mistakes. Twilight Sparkle and Twilight Sparkle. That collectively is, is quite funny. Come on over. Whatever the weird, like, purring, like, woo, that the, the fan makes is a weird noise. They made me, to appeal outside this demographic, they made me slutty. Like, it, it, it sounds like a toga pre. Toga pee? Like the Pokemon? Oh, I can't, I can't make you cross that line, huh? Oh, we gotta, we gotta line you two. You two up. I need you both to be rammed into the wall. That's some puzzle solving, hey? Look at me go. What will they do to you? Edward Cunnilingus. Cull Cullenlingus. The, the joke is a, is a bit more to the joke than I gave it credit for. Hold space, Edward. Oh, I have to switch between the characters. Gotcha. He just, he just lights up his face, all sparkly and nice, and now he's Batman. Which, I don't mean to make fun of, I'm fully on board with. I think he'll make a great Batman. Love Miley Cyrus. I think, look, I think it's good women and teens have more say in the media, so please don't take this level as sexist or ageist. Some of my best friends are underage girls. Oh, <laughs> it's kind of kind of being a little weird about it all of a sudden. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I'll force you all to line up. This isn't going to work the way I was hoping it was going to, actually. I hope I'm not stuck now. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm, mm-hmm. That's what I need. You got to start at the top there to line them up. Heck yeah. Sorry, Miley. Sorry you're seemingly, like, I don't know, left out. Want to hang out? I have to sell the guy. I have to sell the guy. I can't tell you what it really is. What's in real world while I'm under age? It's too for me. I'm all the way. When I'm on this stage, is an M &M song. Love the way you lie. Well, I get Why are we doing as as teen idols? Happened to be black, fade a baby, one less only girl is like this is my world 2.0 found off YouTube, squawk you too. Haters want me hung, cause I'm young and me making my friends means breaking harmon. And I love it. Wait, wait, wait. Gross. Ew, no. Yeah, okay, yeah, that's a good place to stop. That was what I thought would happen if Bieber's agent tried to make him more macho. While I was animating this, Bieber killed a cop on CSI. <laughs> it has begun. <laughs> Yeah, then he got a bunch of tattoos and stuff. I don't know. He's a he's a bad boy Bieber now. Screw your ending. Have some ponies. Aw, oh, shucks. They seem nice. I thought I'd click around and see if any of them were, I don't know, an achievement or something. Earthquakes. Haiti gonna hate. Oh, jeez. Don't fall. I'll just sit here and just, uh, just hang out. Just chill. Just enjoy myself. It seems like I'm quickly running out of options, though. There's not a lot I can do about this. How do I know which side is going to disappear? Oh, that was my own panickedness. Haiti, Brazil, Chile, China, New Zealand, Japan. Some worlds just want to watch men burn. Oh, wow. It's, like, random the way that it's drawing these, I think. Maybe, maybe is that slightly different this time? I think it's slightly different, actually. Huh. Oh, come on. That one was harder than the last one, even. Maybe you're literally, like, not supposed to be able to survive this one. I've taken a few more attempts at it, and, like, that first one was borderline my, my best chance 
And I blew it. Oh, this has been promising so far. Oh god, I don't know which side's gonna disappear. Ah, ah, no, too, too jumpy, too jumpy. I could have done it. I'd look at this tiny little piece of land I got. Must just stay standing. Ah. There's a real chance that it's designed to, like, always eliminate all the ground before 30 seconds is up. I think it's programmed to alternate deleting left of and right of, maybe? And then, like, this one will do above and then this one will do below, which means all I would have to stay- I don't know, but I'm totally wrong about that. I have no idea. I, I, I gotta move on. I cannot seem to do this one. BP the game. Well, oil be damned. Suck it, you stupid pelican. Hold space to wipe pelican across the floor. Oh yeah, just drag him along. Looking good there, pelican. Sheet! Wipe that up. Get all slicked up, full of oil. Splendid! Dump the oil-soaked pelican in the fire. Holy hot damn! Well, that just seems fun for the whole family, doesn't it? Wonderful! Oh, I see. Then you gotta use that to, like, rocket boost yourself. But you gotta, uh, do better. It's the main thing that's not working here is, is me. Build up some speed with some slick oil? That kinda, that kinda helped, yeah. Squeaky, squeaky! Oil-soaked beakies. Oh, come on. You're too slippery. Oh, good, I got to keep, keep my wet pelican. <laughs> Use oil to get up. Like I need to have that the the sp speed built up. Did I wipe out wipe up the wrong part a little bit? Maybe kind of boost me along. Come on, give me give me the boost. That sweet sweet boost I desire. There we go. And whoop! There is a there's a, a lot of these pelicans at this point. Can I just start burning regular pelicans? That would make things a little easier for me, for sure. Rather than seeking more and more oil, it's a it's a non-renewable resource here, guys, and we're we're wasting it all on our pelicans. Surely we could find a more green means of burning up these uh, these pelicans. It's unfortunately one thing that like wind and solar will never be able to replace, though, is. They're not nearly flammable enough to destroy a species with, which is just a damn shame. Wow, there's legit a full-on BP logo off to the side there, too. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Soak. Soak them up. Give it here, please. Oh, please let me just drop down and reset up top. Oh, it's so slippery. It's so difficult to soak up things with. Gotta scrub quickly, frantically. Oh, it's still not enough. We need more. More! Oh, I could have just hit the button again. That's far easier than what I was planning to do. Damn it! All these oil slicks and, and massive spills and, and environmental catastrophes sure are inconveniencing me personally. I feel as though my own personal, uh, my own social commentary doesn't feel quite as refined. <laughs> Nutcase is more of a more of like a George Carlin type and I'm more of a I don't even know I can't even compare myself to a comedian because the only ones I can think of are like legitimately good comedians that I would Never think that I could live up to All's well that ends BP is oil well. Oh God, they're just I realize he's just rubbing that pelican, but it kind of looks like he's violating that pelican in hindsight it looks like he's humping the pelican. <laughs> either we, either way, BP fucked them over. Yeah, it's not good. The terrible timeline of infinite power. April 2010, BP oil spill, which at the time was probably like a year old incident. March 2011, nuclear Fukushima. Fukushima. November 2011, wind turbine decapitates parachutist. Did that happen? That's messed up. Solar power plant, July 2012, worst sunburn accident in history. No, these are after the game was released. Those are more predictive. 
I don't think a wind turbine decapitated a parachutist. But they do kill a lot of bats. Look it up. Like a shitload of bats. This intermission is a little worse. You cannot live without me. If you kill me at the end of the, ga the game's boss fight, everyone will die. Can you live with yourself knowing you killed them all? You cannot handle that kind of guilt. Trust me. I know. I know what that guilt feels like. Look at me. Look at me. I am broken. As you are. Numbers. Hex codes. Exclamation points. Morse code. Which that probably means something. Probably translates. <laughs> but I have no real idea. Money, 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 money. Well, that was horrifying. Do you think you're the hero? No, that was the first bit that I missed there. Jeez. Apps the game. Give touch screens the finger. Flip ang fling angry bird. Flip angry bird. Barely miss one damn pig. No, oh, we're back to doing the, the app thing again with more more jobs. What's he throwing at us? Chemicals? Bombs? Ham? <laughs> Oh, they're angry birds. They're different angry birds. Oh god, I just wanted to pet the little guy. <laughs> little cut the rope slash fruit ninja something or other going on there. Wow, that level just really took care of itself. This will kill me, yes? Yeah, <laughs> yes. <laughs> this should be easy as can be. Do I need to avoid that first auto flip? Is that is that screwing me over in some way? Ah, there we go. Crushed it. Nailed it. Oh, I recognize that little guy too. From some game that I've at least seen at some point. I'm not going to remember ever at any point. Oh my goodness. The Forbidden App. I want to know. Oh. Did it just fart? No fart apps. Is that a thing? Did Apple make a specific thing that banned fart apps? Apprehension over Apple applications. Because it appears appeasing Apple's app store rules is appalling. Tea Party the game. Bring you to a boil. We got our Uncle Sam Obama combo here. Dipping the tea bags into the water. Come on, just dunk, dunk a roo there, Barack. And then use the physics of that to rocket lift yourself back up. Come on, come on, big boy. There we go. This is very oddly tricky. Oh, just like a tea bag, I presumably probably have to like re dip myself every time. Oh, the the physics just need to be like. 10% less floaty when you're when you're aerial controlling because this is kind of much more difficult than I think it should be. I think you gotta dunk yourself. That flings you back up, then you can jump off there. The next jump will be even higher, but it's like I just end up hitting the wrong tea bag on the way up. Ah oh, damn you! Like, I'm anticipating some sort of Boston Tea Party, something or other. Up, 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 okay, okay, we're getting near. Try not to have too much side to side. Oh, okay, wow, 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 that just took some serious learning. Don't know what this level was supposed to mean, feel free to make your own political metaphor. I guess I kind of, I kind of did. Spilling the tea is like a thing now. I don't really know if people use that phrase like nine, ten years ago. Obama's birth certificate, Osama's death certificate. What the hell else do you want? Social networks. Mubark cuts off internet, so internet cuts off Mubark. Sign out, aka get the fuck out. Twitter and Tumblr, following strangers is now cool again. <laughs> Weird. What an uncomfortable way to think of social media. LinkedIn? Profit? Formspring? Is our profit. Yeah, I definitely have a LinkedIn. I've like never used it. No one uses Ping or MySpace. Musicians are antisocial. I don't even remember Ping. I'm 
guessing it was another music thing. Why are all social networks blue? That is kind of, it's a little bit of a thing, isn't it? It's probably the same reason why red is so common in like fast food. You'll see it in like Arby's, KFC, McDonald's, whereas then there's like fresh fast food that uses green, like uh, Subway, and I can't think of other examples, but there's like a really interesting design philosophy where once one person establishes that and people have these relations of like, oh, red and yellow, that means fast food, then other products and companies start leaning into that. Like other fast food chains make sure their logo incorporates those incorporates the same colors. So once one social media was blue, they all just kind of followed suit. Life is just a game. And now with social gaming. Oh my goodness, I can't even read this. Press one to rewind and two to forward. Log out in this amount of time. YouTube the game. 129 people are Vuvuzulas. Thumbs up if you're a YouTuber. Yay, turd. I like the part when comments pop. <laughs> oh, that is a thing that a lot of channels do, isn't it? 143 people are beavers. First, second, thumbs up if you played the game. Thumbs up if you love beaver. 79th, thumbs up if you saw 000. Thumbs if you hate beaver. Wow, YouTube comments well and truly have just not changed, hey? Get whiter teeth, slim body cam, girl. 142 people are, oh my god damn. Yep, I mean, that that's still prevalent as well. Never got better in that sense. Google Plexith. We got an annoying orange and apple. I don't know who that is. Oh, Friday, Friday, it's Rebecca Black. Oh, and the, the old spice guy, double rainbow. Uh, hide your kids, hide your wife. Just any YouTuber who, sh like, makes their cleavage their personality, I guess. I am a mofo. I don't know who this guy is, but I like him, I think. I like the part when comments pop. Si sign out. End it all. Kill the badly written comments. Kill the badly written comments and badly pronounced and enunciated, apparently. Capitalization punishment. Capital punishment. And then, and then I just got to click up on this. Or, oh, no, 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 I I think I actually have to... Wait, could I have been, like, moving around that whole time? Oh, my God. It wasn't just about the jokes. The comments were platforms. That's the most incredible thing. I can't believe I missed that. Okay, you kind of got to do it in order then. <laughs> to, like, actually... <laughs> Be able to move forward through things properly. Oh, I didn't think that would work. I guess it's a personal mission from me to everyone else here. Oh, dang it. To work on making some, uh, some more unique comments, comment formats, specifically for this video. You've been called out. You've been called out nine years ago. <laughs> And apparently, largely didn't change. Can I jump all the way to the comments pop? Where, where, where is there a platform there? Oh, all right, you gotta go backwards at that point. This is tricky. And I'm, I'm really embarrassed by the amount of time it's taking now all of a sudden. That's just, just not any good at all. That one sticks around. I know that because I read it like three or four times Stay while trying to keep up with them. Stop there on par with Ben and True. All the YouTuber hide characters are your wife, getting together. A romantic life for all, forever. Sometimes no, ladies. I'll post videos wanting fame. Cause if Rainbow Shot tried to get the fame show spotlight, why then not to the same? Oh, so Every video just videos. getting sent out into the interwebs. <laughs> The trends justify the memes. Who gets sick of viral videos? Never. They'll be funny forever. They were funny once and funny forever. Bisexual musicians. We buy bisexual. Kesha, Lady Gaga, Katy Perry? Space. Oh, yeah. Still just turns you into a cloud. Which, like, I guess each one of them kind of has, like, an ability, right? You could wall jump. That's like a really effective callback and use of multiple weird, seemingly unrelated mechanics. 
and Katy Perry gets a, the double rainbow double jump for some reason. I think that's Katy Perry, right? That's like gotta be what they were going for there. Kesha, you think you can just slip on through there? Yeah, that's your thing. Apparently, for some totally unknown reason. <laughs> Lady? Katie? Double jump? I guess all of you are, are pretty agile. I could probably use anyone to get at any one of these. Specifically, that one has to be Katie, because she's, like, limited in her jumping. But interchangeably, Gaga and... Kesha should be pretty good at getting where they need to be. Legitimately, when I saw bisexual musicians, then I, I, I fully anticipated, like, something Freddie Mercury related. But apparently not, not the direction we're going here. Yeah, uh-huh. Just keep the button depressed. Why? Why does that not work? I even had them switch spots and it didn't do anything. I couldn't figure out what was going wrong. I went looking it up. Apparently other people have issues with this level. A Nutcase Nightmare joked about instead of making a walkthrough, they would make a hop through for the series. That's too funny. Uh, sounds like it's a really particular glitch. It happens like once in a while, one in a thousand times or whatever. Hard to squash. I just gotta, you just gotta reset from the pause menu. I just noticed all the, the smoke is composed of a bunch of the little whatever they are. Little hoppy faceless people stacked on top of each other, transparent and rotating. That's such a funny extra little detail that's so hard to notice and actually creates a really effective looking effect. And fingers crossed. Huh. You can skip a level if you're stuck. I guess I'm skipping that one. How are bisexual musicians like the iPad? Insert joke about orientation lock. Yeah! <laughs> or this probably meant to be like a, yeah! Like the who, Horatio, the boss. It's all come down to this. Creepy, isn't it? Oh my god, those eyes are freaking. He's killing everyone. I guess he kind of said he would, didn't he? Oh my god. I, uh... This is really, like, fast-moving and panicky feeling. There's something about indie horror developers who love giving cartoony characters like more realistic eyes. I've seen that done quite a bit and it's it's terrifying and it's effective every time. An angry bird got launched out of like the pelican explosive thing. Mm, sorry, devil raven boy. How? How? Like just land in between there. Oh god, gravity flipping. Yep, yep, more more of that. It's really really hard. <laughs> to work with and, and ensure I'm still going the correct direction. Flip! Flippy zippy! Oh, that's some mind warping. No, it's, uh, it's best to just skip that first one, actually. Alright. Flip and flip. Oh, my god. Oh, do you know what? I basically have to save uh, one, one jump. Or save both jumps, because I think I could probably just... Just do this. Hep, hep, and oh, come on. See, I, I okay, I, I initiated the first jump, double jump. Yeah. <laughs> but I also died. So, oh no, it's fine, fine. It's still, it's still attacked. It's good. The T thing has returned for whatever, whatever reason. Whatever the non joke was that was delivered there. Come on, jump on, jump on top of each other's super tall hats, okay? Just make some room. Get on, get on up there. Great, that worked. Exactly how it was meant to. Moves, stays, stays, moves. Oh my goodness. Uh, <laughs> it seems difficult to utilize. What? No, 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 no. I think I understand. I need to, I need to like separate them here slightly. If I'm right on this corner here, that doesn't quite work still. Robert? There, there, there we go. I had to get it right on those edges. No! <laughs> go back. Go, go back to where you were. There we go. I, I, if I hold 
space and have them on the two corners and spot between them. There we go. Managed to hold them in place. Undress. Oh, you can't rip off the eyes. That'd be too weird, I guess. Weird tentacle mouth with the eyeballs, though. Little, little tentacle peen. And just a bunch of other tentacle -y, gross non thing. <laughs> I just wanted to stop pelicans from falling on you. Oh, God. Okay. There's probably some assemblage here that makes sense. Can't click on it. At one point, that was words. Is this heaven? I'd like to go back to Earth, please. So I'll just jump on off. Oh, God. You blast yourself through him by, like, jumping from way high up like that. Holy crap. <laughs> That was a, some pretty over-the-top shit there. Is this like... Did this series receive a conclusion? Like, I didn't really ever think that there was some larger story being told or like, that it was building towards anything. Mind blown! Pretty much no one's making it out of this. Managed to destroy the entire world and thank you for putting up with this. <laughs> Skyrocketed the entire Earth away, did we? Achievements? Ooh, I got a few! Libya! No, skip, we already have done that. I said it like Libya, like hooray for liberals or something, but you know, it's Libya. <laughs> Those were just for completing different portions of the game, that's all that was. Different uh, achievements for doing things quick, the timed levels. Oh, and don't die on these levels. But what what was this? Make a character, take a screenshot to get a display icon, or unlock everyone is you mode to play as yourself in game. Well that's kind of like a fun little thing that you can you can mess around with then. There's also further customization options that I, I would not have access to just yet. Uh, that's fun. That's like a fun thing to implement. I will try to not jump, not die in the, the double rainbow jumper. That'll be the one singular, well, harder than I thought it would be. Maybe I just chucked myself into a pit. I'm never going to do it. Whatever. I'm <laughs> not, not skilled enough, I guess. I haven't talked to, to Nikki about this at this point, but I would love, love, love to do a flashlight episode on this series. I think they would probably have some really cool things to say, some like retrospective about creating this. When they were a teenager, over 10 years ago, or like, you know, in that window of 12 to 9 years ago for the three separate games, and just kind of like adding some perspective to it because like it comes across as so so cynical <laughs> i'm curious how their worldview has changed and and what they think of the series looking back that sort of thing hey maybe if people have questions that they think would be good to ask you could chuck those in the comments for me and i'll, I'll take that into consideration because it's going to be a while probably before i get around to making that so yeah, that could be a fun thing. I'll add that as like a pinned comment to these videos for people to respond to. Thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you again soon.